the question is the the question I can see the economic or monetary alliance between Russia, China, South Africa, Brazil, India, called BRICS. The, the question I can see BRICS emerging as a relevant force in the world, progressive force in the world, BRICS. But the question is not seeing the world of Islam showing anything at all. As though the world of Islam simply eating roti chanai and drinking teh tarik. Our problem is not our governments. It is not the function of governments to be the conscience of the Ummah of Muhammad alayhi salatu wasalam. The conscience of the Ummah of Muhammad alayhi salatu wasalam, the ulama of Islam. And unless and until the ulama of Islam develop the capacity to be able to conduct the kind of analysis I have just given to you tonight, they won't even know what you're talking about when you speak about BRICS. Because this is not taught in the Darul Ulum. They go and they study, they get a degree, they come out, they study this kitab, that kitab, that kitab, that kitab. And you come out and you get a salary. And you don't, you're a scholar, that's not scholarship. <laughs> scholarship is not that way. No, you're not going to have the world of Islam change this way. We have to build a new generation of scholars of Islam. That's why we're establishing the Institute of Islamic Eschatology. Tomorrow, I will be in my grave. But inshallah, there will be students all over the world who are studying Ilmu Akhiru Zaman, who tomorrow will come out and on their shoulders will be the struggle, the intellectual struggle tomorrow. I am confident, inshallah, there will be a difference tomorrow. Any more questions?